In this video, I'm going to connect my Surface PC to my HTC 8X phone. Now this phone is a AT&T phone and it has a data plan that includes a tethering account. On my Surface, I'm going to show that I currently have no networks available. It looks like I have one network available with very low with a very low signal from my neighbor's house. I'm going to go to Internet Explorer here to show that I have no connections to the Internet at the moment. Then while that's happening, I'm going to go over to my phone and I'm going to go to my settings section and open this system setting called Internet Sharing and turn on the sharing. Now you'll notice that down here, it's small, I know the, the text is small on this phone, I'll put some screenshots up along with this blog post, is this has the name of the wireless access point and the password I need to use to connect to it. Now I've already connected this surface earlier today, so it should already have that access point there. Let's go see. Click on settings, go back to my available networks. There's my phone access point. I'll click on that and say connect. Now since I've already entered my password earlier, I don't need to re-enter it. It's quite simple to do though. You would just click here, click on connect, and then a, and a window will pop up that asks you for your password. Now I should be able to go back here and do a refresh. And there's my website. So as you can see, it only takes a minute to set up an internet sharing point and connect to it with your Surface PC.